Well, Carrie, the sheriff is battling critics, including the American Civil Liberties Union. The ACLU argues workplace raids run roughshod over the U.S. Constitution. The sheriff says he's not about to stop. Deputies at Allied Tube at 27th Avenue and Virginia. They load three suspected illegal immigrants into a van. The sheriff says it's the result of a year-long investigation. The raid comes a day after a federal judge ruled the sheriff's office illegally arrested Julian and Julio Mora, a father and son, one a U.S. citizen, and the other a legal permanent resident, during a raid at a landscaping company in 2009. The Moras zip-tied and held for three hours before being released. I was upset because uh, I am a, a citizen here and we weren't doing nothing wrong. Uh, all we were doing was taking my dad to work. That's all we were doing. Arpaio, what he typically does is he conducts these raids in a manner that is in um, total disregard for people's constitutional rights. He'll typically go in there, arrest people, and then ask questions later. And then that's not the way um, that we operate in this country. Sheriff Arpaio says his deputies follow the law. I'm going to tell you right now, I think after three years, if we were racial profiling, there'll be a lot of, lot of uh, heat. We have the Justice Department looking into my office for the past two years on alleged racial profiling. Where are they? I don't see any uh, proof. The next step for the Moras is a federal trial this year on whether the sheriff and his deputies will be found liable for the illegal arrests and the amount of damages the father and son may receive. Reporting live, Steve Kraft, Fox 10 News. Get MyFoxPhoenix.com on your iPhone free at the App Store and stay connected.